Hey everyone, it's Maria from Diamond Painting with the Besties. How are you? I hope you're all doing well. I hope everyone's week is going well. And yeah, you guys are just surviving. Today we have a post review. So a little backstory about this post review. Um, if you remember last week or so, week and a half ago, um, I had posted an unboxing video of the cute little Diamond Art Clubs that I got on Amazon Prime Day. And I was going to try and set a goal to finish them all by August 1st because August 1st is the start of my Rude Crude and Nude event that I am co-hosting with the fabulous Maritza over at Kiss My Crafts and Christopher Colossa over on his channel. Anyway, um, I went down to Brad's for a bestie weekend and I did get a lot done. The question is, did I make my goal? Well, no. I didn't get them all done, but I did get some done. And so I'm gonna share those with you and I'm going to share with you my progress that I have made as well. So are we ready? Let's get into it. So I do have my journal that you've been staring at for the last couple minutes and everything. So the very first one we're gonna go over is We're Under the Weather You. And that is by Lori Stein. I started it on the 27th of July and finished it on the 28th. I could have finished more of it. Oop, there's peaking, I see peaking. I could have finished this faster, but Brad and I did do some other things throughout the day. So this is the, an adorable little 22.7 by 22.7 round diamond painting. And it had 11 colors with one AB. And I'm sure you can tell what the AB is just by all the glistening um, in the sheep itself. Um, I lined it with this super adorable washi. Isn't that like, it looks like it just goes perfectly. It looks like, you know, they're pinwheels, but it could also look at the top of an umbrella. Um, this was so much fun. Um, I haven't done a round diamond painting in quite some time. And it was so refreshing to just bust out my multi-placer and go to town with, where is this coming from? I hope this is an extra one that was just stuck. And that one didn't fall off. I don't see one that fell off, so it must just have been extra. Okay. So, the entire little canvas is color blocking, except for the sheep. And you could probably tell that there are some regular white drills, 5200, and then there are the white AB mixed in. Everywhere else, I just went and multi-placed, but with this, there was a lot of checkerboarding with twos and threes of the AB. Um... Okay, so round has 11 colors and one AB. And this is my 16th finish for the year. I am totally behind compared to last year, but my goal was to do larger size kits, more licensed kits, um, but that's another story for another time. So my notes that I made for myself that this snack size kit was so stinking cute. It was fun, refreshing, and I highly recommend it. And it was a super fast finish. Um, pros, excuse me, small, great drills, no trash, large area for the ABs. So there was just a lot of ABs, right? That focal point cons, the ABs, although beautiful, the scattering, and there was a lot of single placing. So I really had to reach for a, a negative right there, but, um, this is how I set up my log book. Um, I want to utilize both the stickers because I don't want to throw them out. And that's why I kind of do it this way. I know I have a lot of wasted space right here. Um, I can probably go through and like fill it in with less like regular stickers. But this is what um, it looks like. I usually use um, two pages for Diamond Art Clubs. Whereas if we go back here to like craftably it's just one page or the diamond dots. It was just one page and I could fit it on. So it's only when I do the diamond art clubs. All right. So that was one of the kits that I finished. What do you guys think? There are a couple other ones that are this size that I might go back and snag, but this is just super, super cute. All right, let's move on. The next one that I finished is get my book out of the way and bring this up a little bit. Sorry for this shadow. 
This is Dobby is free. I started this on the 28th of July and I ended on the 29th. And this is um, by WBIEI or Harry Potter from the DAC Amazon shop. <clears throat> and this is my 17th finish. This was a 32.8 by 35.9 centimeter round with 11 colors, but no AB, excuse me, no ABs. And I did not add any. I did it exactly how it was charted. Um, this was so, oh, oh, super cute. I wanted this one so bad. This was color blocking heaven. Not one drop of confetti. We had line blocking through here. Um, a little highlight right there and a little highlight right here. But the rest of it, you guys, is just all color blocking at Dobby's face, his little cheeks, um, the tip of his nose, inside his ears, and some shading. And then, of course, this really nice green background, right? Um, my notes that this is the washi that I used also. And you can see in my notes that I absolutely love this kit. Worked up quick. The drills were amazing, zero trash, tons of color blocking. Um, literally no cons, but I had to pick a con. There was not any ABs. That was absolutely it. Um, I thought that um, this washi, maybe not the pattern, but the color itself, I was very limited on my selection because I just threw a couple rolls in my craft tote before I went down to Brad's. But I thought it worked, the color worked really nicely because it kind of went with his little cloak and his sock. Now, I wanted to show you all of the leftover drills. So since I was there, I decided to keep these because the drills were so great, but you can tell right here that I had plenty of every color between these two kits. Um, I didn't even kit these up. I just picked one color and just went at it. And when I was done, I threw it in a bag and put the sticker from the inventory on it. Um, here are the ABs. So I had a nice little amount left over. I had a lot of 772. Yep, so I had lots of leftovers. So I can put this in my uh, drill stash just in case because you never know when you could run out of a color. All right, so we're going to put this one aside. Now, I did start the third kit, but I did have to leave. So I started this one on July 29th. And before I left Brad's, I was able to get um, this incomplete section done. And this is We Are Sun by Marianne Brome. Um, it's a 32.8 by 32.8 centimeter kit. It's round, there's 23 colors and there's two ABs. Um, and this is, I just used some orange washi right here. I don't have any notes yet, but um, this is the one that I, you know, I wanted to finish it, but I didn't get a chance because it is a little bit more intricate. It's mostly line blocking. I wouldn't really say confetti. Maybe in the middle will be some confetti. Um, and then over on this side, this is all that I was able to complete so far. I didn't even diamond paint um, Sunday night or Monday night, I should say. Um, but what do you guys think? This is really, really pretty. I think this is going to look so nice. I'm definitely going to frame this and put this probably in my kitchen. Um, I really like the red background so far, but, um, yeah, I don't want to go too, too into it because I am not, I'm not finished with it yet. Um, and I will finish it, but what was that? My cat, sorry for that pause. I heard my cat. Anyway, um, I don't want to go too, too into it because, um, it isn't finished and I will want to give it, you know, a post review on its own, but I did want to show you my progress thus far on it. So I'm literally, I'm not quite halfway. I still have like, you know, this section right here to do, and then I'll be like officially halfway done, but it will have to wait. But um, I'm not going to link any of these below because you can just go to the unboxing video and you'll be able to find those kits linked there. It will bring you right to Amazon to the Diamond Art Club shop that's on there. So you guys, that is my post review. That is what I completed out of the three kits I got on my Amazon Prime Day. So I hope that you enjoyed this. Um, let me know what you think. Uh, leave me a comment. And until next time, my friends, I hope that you enjoyed this. And I hope you have a fabulous um, rest of your week.
All right, till next time. Bye, everyone.